الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء والمرسلين Dear Muslim brothers and sisters Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Welcome to Easy Tajweed with Hassan Anas and welcome to fifth part of first lesson In last session we studied about Mutahadrik What is Mutahadrik? So inshallah today we will study about names of Harakat Before start the lesson I am requesting to everyone to subscribe this channel and press the bell icon So let's start the lesson So you can see there is one harakat So this harakat names is Fatha and Nasab Fatha and Nasab two names are there In the Wahi language it's called Abafili So Abafili has two names Fatha and Nasab In Urdu language, it's called Zabar. Zabar has two names, Fatha and Nasab. So, if Fatha comes to any letter, for that letter we can call, that letter is Maftuh or Mansub. For example, Qala. Up of Qaf, you can say there is Fatha. So, for Qaf, we can call Qaf Maftuh. Or Kaf Mansub. So here you can see next harakat. So this harakat names is Kasra and Jaw. Kasra also can call and Jaw also can call. In Dwehi language, it's called Ibifili. So Ibifili has two names, Kasra or Jaw. And in Urdu language, it's called Zail. So Zain has two names, Kasra or Jaw. So if Kasra come to any letter, for that letter we can call, that letter is Maksur or Majroor. For example, Min, Min has Kasra. So for Min we can call Min Maksur or Min Majroor. So here you can see next Harakat. So this harakat names is Lamma or Rafa. In the Wahi language it's called Ubufili. So Ubufili has two names, Lamma or Rafa. In Urdu language it's called Pesh. So Pesh has two names, Lamma or Rafa. So if Lamma come to any letter, for that letter can call, that letter is Malmoon or Marfu'a. For example, Qul. Up of Qaf there is Lamma. So for Qaf we can call Qaf Madmoon or Qaf Marfu'a. So there was a Harakat names. So I hope now you understood about these names. So keep practice and make sure now you can pronounce it correctly. See you in next session. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.